What up guys, hope you're all doing well. Today we're back with another healthy recipe, a prawn and avocado salad. A delicious way to get that protein, the good fats, and also to get those important micronutrients. So without further ado, let's get cracking. For this salad, you'll need peppers, avocados, lime, a bit of parsley, cucumber, a lettuce of your choice, cherry tomatoes, red onions, and of course, some fresh, peeled and deveined prawns. Let's start the story with the prawns. Start by seasoning them with a bit of pepper, salt, some garlic powder, and chili flakes. Of course, add a tad bit more for the extra kick and fat burning effect. Give them a good mix and let's go fry them. In a hot pan, drizzle some olive oil and start frying the prawns. This should only take a couple of minutes, but I do like a little bit of char and color on my prawns. Once cooked, set aside to cool. Now let's prepare everything else for the salad. Start off by cutting your cherry tomatoes in half, then dicing or chopping your red onions into squares then likewise cut your bell peppers into squares as shown followed by some chopped parsley and then avocados to cut the avocados into cubes just follow along as I'm showing you. However, be careful not to cut yourself whilst doing this. You can scoop the cubes out with a spoon or if your avocados are well ripened, just get those fingers messy. Follow this up with your chopped lettuce along with cucumber and add all of these into a bowl. Add a good squeeze of lime followed by a drizzle of olive oil salt and pepper. Add your prawns and give it a good mix. This salad is perfect as is, but it can be accompanied with a humble couple of slices of bread. Here I used a simple white bloomer, which I made just a little while ago. It's got a great crunchy crust with a spongy middle, which is perfect for what I'm going to do next. Remember the pan we fried our prawns in? Well, that has a lot of flavor, so let's not waste that. Heat up that pan again and add a knob of butter. Then, toast your slices of bread until they're nice and golden. Like I mentioned, since the bread I made is quite spongy, it's gonna soak up all that flavor from the prawns, which is perfection. Now all that's left to do is serve that salad onto a plate. And enjoy every bite. Hope you guys love this recipe. Of course, leave a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Hope you all have an amazing day. Until next time, peace.